Hello everyone and welcome back to this Total War Warhammer oh, Let's Play him. Sufra? Since last part, a rebellion has been announced here. Like, it's gonna happen next turn no matter what I do at Ice Drake Fjord. We do have a little garrison there, but it's not gonna be enough to protect it on its own. So how am I going to do this? I've only got limited funds. And since Sufra's went and had done this here, you know what I'm going to do for now? Let's create a save point. Because this could go very badly wrong very fast. But I see a legendary lord in four. A uh, legendary lord? I see the key to getting the whole of the Varg to confederate with me. Forced march vulnerable right there boom fought so they're definitely gonna fight this battle on the battlefield we've got them ambushed we've got them bagged we've got them into rights hopefully and um, I could always load the save if I somehow muck up. But look at that chariot on chariot. Yeah. Because the auto resolve is easily going to win. But it's an ambush, I'm going to fight it. Then once we've won, we can force him to confederate. Um, I'm going to take his war mammoth, and then I'm probably going to delete the army. Oh, it's great weapons, maybe. I'll see. I'll see what I want to get rid of. I'll get rid of some of my stuff and take some of his. <laughs> and then just dump the rest of his army because I can't afford another army at the moment. Especially with those rebellions I'm going to have to sort out. Okay. Oh wait a minute. This is not an ambush ambush? Ah, oh, I thought it was an ambush. Well, he was going to be walking along and then I'd be able to spring out and... Oh, I'm not as confident about this battle anymore. Because I was going to have all my stuff on him easily and... Yeah, okay, okay. We need to be a wee bit smarter about this now then. Oh, we do have these cav units though. Let's group them. Let's put the wolves units all over here. You know, they're technically ranged as well, so let's say uh, I put all three of those units over here. Let's put... No, no, just those two there. Those two there. What's the speed of this? Speed 95, what's the speed of these? Speed, where's speed, 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 92. So you know what? These guys was 92, yep. This is actually faster than them. So let's just group all three of them together. We'll do some ranged skirmishing over here for a bit. Ah, they've got good range though, it's the pain, it's the pain, it's the problem. Right, let's start the battle. Wilfred can go right up. Right, Wilfs. Up here. These have not been ordered yet. Oh, and I've not got these guys moving. Oh, I do. Got those guys moving. Where are these guys moving to? Oh, I wanted them there. I must have sent them somewhere else. Let's see how this goes. Why is it not an ambush? That's what I want to know. He was on forced march. I thought it would have been an ambush. Let's 
So got ranged to that? No. That mammoth's gonna be a pain. I'm gonna have to focus it down with all my ranged, but my range should be very good now with all the buffs. Where is these guys? Because these are Marauder Chariots, so they don't have any range, do they? Where these do... So you got a lot of armor. Is it armor? 85, it does. Missile damage has got anti-armor though, so that's good. So the wolves will be good against it. Let's see if I can tease them into attacking me. Have Wolfric right at the front, see if he can tease them. If all these got skirmish mode on. Where's skirmish mode? Where's skirmish mode? For skirmish mode! Group, halt, set formation, toggle guard mode. Ah, these guys can skirmish. The chariots can. Ah, that's what's going on. Okay. Keep a skirmishing over here. Meanwhile, not much else is going on. Let's make the most of the situation then, deal as much damage as I can. Throw those spears! Oh, they're sending the mammoth over, that's not good. Let's get out of here. Right, stay away from the mammoth. You know what, let's send these guys over here. So if they keep using the mammoth, we've got used to blitz it down. Gonna take our time with this battle because I know we have very few advantages now that it's not an ambush battle. Oh, hello? Ah, they're just turning their line. See if we can get some more volleys into this unit, dwindle their health as much as possible. Come on, my skirmishers! The mammoth's not coming over yet. If it does, I'll lure it into these. Throw those spears! Every unit I can take down and badly hurt before the main combat is going to be awesome. Oh wait, oh, it's turned, it's turned. Right, thrown axes, get back on that chariot. Oh, look at that, we nuked it. We, they turned away. Right, uh, retreat, that's coming for you. Oh no, what happened here? We let them get into combat. Right, can we pull out? Wait, let's pull out, let's pull out. No! 
Right, let's nook that mammoth. If we can take that mammoth out, we'll have a really good advantage. Right, for the Marauder Horsemen, get back over here. Are you still throwing axes? No, you got to be facing them. You should be better than them, though. So if I turn around and charge now... See if we can sneak in here. Get some damage in on them. Let's just sneak in there. These guys are on skirmish. But is the mammoth faster than them? Oh, I did not take that. I didn't think of that. Right, spearmen. I did not think that the mammoth would be faster than them. I did not take that into my calculations. But fortunately, I've got four units here, so we're just like running for all we're worth. Spearmen get in there and hold it up. Right, brilliant, brilliant, and here come the javelins. Chariot's combat's not very entertaining, isn't it? Into the back of it, just break it, free up the unit. Oh, the mammoth's gone! <laughs> right, this battle's going really well now. Right, you can get back to your position over here. Brilliant. All right, we're tickling away at this army. The mammoth's gone. That was the biggest threat. Um, one of the units of chariots is gone. One of the great weapon units is basically gone. If I send you over here, I'm going to see if I can get the boat on a large number of them. Oh, I'm able to draw them into me, maybe. So just summon the boat and go. Come on, boat. We did quite a bit of damage. That does quite a bit of damage. Oh, are they coming at me now? Are they charging? Nope, they're just reforming. Right, let's finish off this unit. Off melee modes. That unit's still seriously alive? Right, I cannot get into range of those guys. Come on, die now. And they're gone. <coughs> oh, that'd actually be quite handy if they're going to send these guys out to protect the flank now. <coughs> if I draw them out, then charge them. Right, these units, let's now send them over here, see if we can deal with that chariot on the this flank. And I'm almost tempted to go for a charge now. They're sending out spearmen over here, actually, so let's be helpful. Chariots, just quickly run them down. Make sure they're not coming back. A boat there right now would be very good. Deals quite a bit of damage. Now, 
Oh, chariots, get out of there, get out of there, get out of there. Right, I think it's time now. We've wasted enough time. Let's sound the general advance. Let's start the advance. Right, let's get this charge underway. Right, and get these guys to come further up. Let's go all just go to there. Right, where's Mr. Wilfricky? Give me another boat. They're like so. Take all my range, finish off their range unit there. Right, we're overrunning them. come around there they're gonna charge front into them their whole army's thinking about running and victory Whew. we did it a wee bit slow and methodical but we did it really well lovely stuff Pity the mammoth's completely gone. I'm not going to be able to claim that for my army. Oh, we did that quite well. With minimum losses. Wolfric tallied himself up quite a large number of kills. We played it a wee bit smarter than I did before. Decisive victory indeed. You know what? I don't think there's anything I'm desperate left over in this army I want. I might just attack them again to get that wee bit more money and more experience for Wilfric. I think that's what I'm going to do, actually. Oh, wow, that's a lot of money. Boom. Wow, another ward save. Even more money. Right. right now, diplomacy. A timely arrival. They should My take the peace tree. Actually, first of all, winter two. Okay. A timely arrival. My warhounds have not eaten in days. Payments, demand payment. Every single penny. Still high? Lovely. All the world is made from right, we've got a new problem in the form of all this land over here we own. What the hell's a Kislev army doing all the way up here? And how the hell is it not dead from the attrition? Right, ah, we're not quite in touch with Winter Pyre yet. We've got this faction between us. Oh yeah, we are here. Just at the Vard camp. But Wolfric's ranked up. He needs to be 18 before he gets his mammoth. Let's start going for that, because we're going to want to get them soon. We're going to want to get them soon. It's for here. 
Recruit me those two regiments for now. That's still not going to be enough. Just going to be enough to hold. Do that. Take them, disband. That's right here. We're going to have a rebellion. Recruit Lord. Recruit Mr. Stupid. I'm going to want that up ASAP so I can get those men I was on about. As for everyone else, I need money. I need money. We've got a lot of sorting out to do. Go for that. Right, let's end turn. Oscar! Quite enjoyed that last battle. Weakened them as much as possible before the main combat commenced. Then Wolfric was able to nuke their legendary lord and I was then able to have a nice time. Boom, right, we can just start us off that. Give me the money. As for up here, what? let's get rid of you. The eternal challenge. I rip out guns. Boom. Give me the money. Get a marching. It's for here. Let's get him this. Yes. Let's recruit him. You know what? By the time he gets to him, it's not going to be make any difference. They're all recovering. Would quite like that. Be able to get our money building here. We need to colonize here at some point. Soon, hopefully, we can start expand like properly. Just raiding, just doing what Norska is meant to be. Same turn. Got to play incredibly aggressively, those Norska. Cannot play defensively at all. You do not have the money for it. Almost all my money's come from battles. But now that I'm starting to get lands and starting to build lots of economy buildings, lots and lots of them will really drastically increase the money I make and the, especially the raiding money I make. Especially once I start raiding the lucrative empire My challenge undeniable is to court right right more experience for Wilfric Lots of money, it'll be brilliant. Right. Let's get them champions of the north. My challenge 
We at war with these guys again. No, why is it? Oh, red because of Maddenberg. Force march your way down. Oh, he does have a large army now. That's a lot of berserkers. We do have a lot of veterancy on our side, though. Money, 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 We just need to get a lot of our settlements dealt with. It's a wee bit slapdash at the moment with stuff all over the place. We haven't even started raising things to the Hound or anything yet. Which I'm quite looking forward to do. We're going to need to do that soon. Wintertooth, I'm a wee bit worried about Wintertooth coming down that one border I've got with them. But I'm not too worried about it. I think they are at war with that other Slaneshi looking faction. Mate of the Wolves. Let's go for the Mate of the Wolves. Right, Mr. Wanderer. Head to there. And build yourself a raiding camp. Oh, nasty. He's got a guy in the battlefield, so then he's going to have that, plus... a oh, large garrison. Ugh. I think I'm going to need reinforcements. Unless he comes to me. So we're just gonna. He's making a good money raiding right now. So let's uh, get some upgrading done first of all. Get some of this mess cleaned up. There's a lot going on everywhere, all over the place. Oh, marble. Brilliant. Trade resource. We really need the trade resource. We need public order sorted as well. Right, we're out of money anyway, so it's in turn. I'm quite happy making 2 key a turn. We can build up a wee bit for a bit. Unless a full stack comes walking down here, then I'll be crying. Well, it looks like the Slaneshi faction's actually taken over here. So I don't have a place with Wintertooth anymore. Brilliant. So I do not need to worry at all now. And if that faction down south attacks me, that's exactly where I want to be. Because they'll be attacking me and I'll fight them in the open. They won't have their village reinforcements. I can beat them there quickly. Monster hunting page one has been done. Nice. Nothing I can need here particularly. Let's get a money-making building. Whilst we're at it, let's start the first of these. Choice, my lord. The beast once caught will be quite the prize. That's our first monster hunt underway. We have to raid here. The towers have cracked, but we already own it. Let's uh, leave these for now in case we need them. Yep, look. Winter Tooth's there all on its own. So I'm safe on this side for now, apart from rebellions. Rebellions will still be a pain. We're all good. Where does army go? 
I do not trust that whatsoever. But the beginning of the next part, I may attack that and then attack the city if he's not there. But he's probably just sitting here hidden. That'll give us more money. That's for here. Money, 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 all the things. Money, all the things. Before we get an upgrade for the monolith to level 3 soon. So we can get the Abdissian. And this shall be a part. Hope you've all enjoyed this. Yeah, the campaign's starting to heat up. I'm starting to have control over things now. It doesn't feel as risky anymore. Hope you're all enjoying it. We are, um, I'd say, about 70% of the way to owning all of Norska. Once we do, we are going to be rampaging Kislev and the Empire like mad and trying to summon our big chaos buddies from up here. So, yep. Hope you've all enjoyed this. Join me next time. Bye-bye.